All right, here we go. All right, so we have a whole bunch of treasure maps that we're gonna go ahead and uh, attempt to do. They're all local uh, in our region, so we don't have to go too terribly far. Uh, just so you know, I am going to be streaming and recording uh, this whole uh, treasure map stuff. So hopefully you don't run into any hiccups. All right. And unfortunately, we just have to settle with being on a sloop for now. Um, that's really all we're able to make. Shit! Oh god! My apologies. <laughs> it's okay. You'll learn how to do the sails eventually. <laughs> also, you see that bottle right there? That that orange or that purple thing right there on the water? That's a treasure bottle. That's how you uh, find the treasure maps. All right. Again, keep eyes peeled for ghost ships, please. For sure. All right, our first stop is to go to Penwood Island. Well, actually, I might not be able to just because of how the wind is going to be blowing, but I guess we'll see. And hopefully, uh, this video, once I post it, will give you all a bit more insight into how to do treasure maps, because I know a lot of people are really struggling with those right now. That's primarily because of bugs, I'd like to imagine. Um, This is my first time having to use a handling sail. Uh, my mate, he doesn't have the speed sail learned yet. We were trying to level up, but. You can actually rotate it fully, like to the uh, area where it's greenest. Yeah, there you go. Alright, and this is going to be extra fun because now it's becoming nightfall. I mean, don't get me wrong, that makes the uh, ghost ships really stand out, which is nice. I'm just hoping that the ghost ships aren't cluttered around the coast. Um, but we do have to sail over a good bit of open water, so I'm honestly really concerned. Um, for anyone who does end up joining the stream and watching, uh, it may end up getting cut short because A, my power may end up going out. It's, it's storming something fierce outside right now. Um... Or B, this ship may end up getting sunk. We'll see. I don't think this thing can outrun a ghost ship. It's just one handling sail. And honestly, I mean, the speed sail is definitely faster. We're honestly absolutely terrified of doing this. It's just we have so many treasure maps in our region that we almost feel like we have to do them. Um, especially once we actually manage to make it to a free port uh, so we can actually hire some crew because we're obviously in the process of building a galleon and there's only four of us, so we want to be able to man it. 
I'm just hoping that it isn't like, I don't know, 4,000 gold per man or something like that, because that would just be absurd. Alright, nice thing is, is we can already see Penwood Island out in the distance. Dang, it's small. Yeah, it's a really small island, but it'll make finding the treasure really easy. Uh, you have, uh, plenty of ammo on you, right? Enough. Alright, cool. We'll be there soon. We'll be there soon. My head's on a freaking swivel right now. Also, side note, let me know if that's too loud. Uh... Because right now my mic is also going to be picking up stuff from my speakers, and then I also have the desktop audio playing, so. Oh no, fog. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Oh my god! Great. What did you say about hiccups? Yeah, yeah. There's a glow ahead of us. Oh, yeah, that glow's fine. That's, um, one of the floating loot boxes, basically. And now I see a ghost ship. Alright. Turn the sail north. If we can just make it to the island and dock, we'll be fine. Ah, shit, that ghost uh, ship is way too close. And there's two more. Shots. Yeah, I see them too. Turn away. It's cool though. I wonder how much grinding is going to be wasted in cannonballs. Good question. Alright, well, that's a benefit. I think we lost them. Q. 
key word, I think. I can still see them in the background, but uh, actually, they're still relatively. Oh boy. Yeah, they're still following us. So we may end up losing this ship too, because right now they're aggro. They will. Oh, there it is. Awesome. That's the update that we freaking needed. I'm going to try and see if I can get us around to the safe side of the island. I'm going to try. Downfall is I'm freezing to death. Yeah, I'm about to die. Turn the sail, please. And yeah, you're not kidding, hero. Alright, hero. Though, uh, don't be prepared to go out in the water too terribly much, because right now, as it stands, things are cancerous. Alright, so, we made it to the island. Alright, here we go. Grab all these treasure maps. My god, freaking everything that could go wrong did. <laughs> I mean, seriously? A freaking typhoon, and then we get bombarded with. Ugh! I mean, at least it didn't really take any damage, so that's good. Now it's starting to warm up. Okay, there we go. Not dying of cold anymore. Thank God. All right. All right. Well, now that you're geared back up, we can actually do this. I mean, we're parked nice and close. There's not really anything that can be 
done in the event that, you know, a ghost ship just decides to randomly wander up on us. So hopefully that doesn't happen. On a bright note, though, it seems like this guy can outrun ghost ships, which is good. Yeah. All right, so... All right, well, the way. Seconds, there we go. See, there's that big pillar of light that I keep on telling people about. Actually, wait, I don't think you can see it. You'd have to equip the map. <laughs> see that, though, everybody? Yeah, I read that there's a marker, but I didn't know what it was. Here, let me throw this map at you just so you can see. Equip it to your zero slot. And look over there by that big rock. Well, that's nice and easy. Yeah. Now, I have some people commenting on my YouTube videos saying that the pillar of light isn't displaying. Now, either that is a bug, or uh, they're just not on the right island. I don't know which, though. All right, uh, let me get that map back. Oh, wait, you dropped it. Never mind. All right. All right, let's do this. You guys were a uh, trick for me out. Hey, man. Oh, hey, sorry about that. Yeah, we're uh, doing some treasure maps. I'm uh, streaming and recording it right now because some people were asking for it, so. It's just a huge pain to do right now with uh, the ghost ships being everywhere. Yeah, hopefully that uh, changes in an hour. Yeah, it, it will. Um, the next patch is going to be fixing all that. Thanks. So I just disabled the uh, desktop audio, so now it shouldn't be, like, ridiculously loud. Alright, you ready for this? Yeah, do we both get XP or just the map holder? Uh, we both do. Um, so, here's the thing. Whenever uh, they first pop up, wait for them to start moving around before you shoot them. Also, try to get headshots. That's really the only way to kill them quickly. Um, if we can get to a vantage point, that would be really good. I think that there's a rocker here we can use. Just look around a little bit, see if there's a way up. Oh, yeah, here we go. It's on this side. And I prematurely fired. Yeah, their hitboxes are a little weird. Yeah, I missed both times. That's alright, I did too.
I hate it when they dig like that. Don't worry about damaging. Whenever he digs, they full heal. Just wait for him to come back up. There he is. <laughs> Equipping the shovel. Let's see, we got 85 gold coins for that, um, a tier 2 cargo saddle, whatever that is. Uh, we got, <laughs> unfortunately the three blueprints that we got were junk, a blueprint for a fine stone pickaxe, a blueprint for a tier 2 saddle, and a blueprint for fine hide gloves. Yeah, that's crap. Let's keep moving. All right, next. Um, I kind of want to take a second to respect for faster reloads, though. Yeah, go for it. I have to reload anyway and figure out where the next one is. Yeah, I mean, as you can see, that's what the treasure maps and whatnot look like. Whenever you're there, whenever you do them, I'm actually going to do a whole bunch of them in a string so you can really see what to look for, um, and hopefully it'll help some of you people out um, who are struggling a little bit with it. And I hate it whenever it does that. Okay, okay, stop. Stop it. Jesus. All right. Okay, uh, alright, so it is tilted like that, which tells me that it's along this coast here, okay. Oh, and side note, my bow hasn't degraded. Really? Mine did. Strange. I'm getting uh, some fiber and flint right quick for some more arrows. Cool. I'm gonna need some. Yeah, you and me both. So now the real question is, can we get back to base without running into more problems?
getting some fiber? Yeah. All right, awesome. There's oregano here. Yeah. Oh, that doesn't drop seeds. Nah, most herbs don't. Alright, how much fiber you got on you? Only 44. I'm gonna oh, okay. use it to make my arrows. Oh, okay. I forgot that you can make your own arrows. <laughs> Do you need any flint or thatch? Nope, I think I'm alright. Alright. It'll be enough for the next time at least. Gotcha. Alright, so I'm pretty sure I know where the next one is. God, I don't know why those maps are so laggy. Yep, there it is. I mean, look at that. Even during the middle of the day, that pillar of light is just beaming. And, you know, this is the two different treasure maps. So, I mean, you know, if you're having the issue where the beam of light isn't displaying, honestly, it's probably because you're not on the right island. The maps twist and turn so it can be a little confusing as to what side the treasure is actually on and whatnot. Uh, and sometimes you'll have the islands that look very, very, very similar. Um, now, I mean, don't get me wrong, I could be mistaken, it could still be bugged out as hell. But just, you know, keep trying, keep looking around, try something a little different, stuff like that, and, you know, see if that ends up fixing uh, the issue that you're having. Um, that, and, you know, look forward to the patch in about an hour. <laughs> Okay, that's annoying. Can't climb up on that. Is that a wrecked ship right out there? That's a wrecked ship. There's somebody out there, too. Good. Hey, guys! What's up? Hello. Are you finding treasures? Uh, yeah, we're actually doing some treasure maps. The friggin' cursed ships just murdered everything here. So your ship's probably gonna be next. 
Well, uh, we have we have our fingers crossed. I'm hoping that uh, we can be safe for a little bit longer because we have like four or five maps to do on this island. I'm streaming it and everything just to try and help people uh, understand how these are done. Hey, is this your first one you're doing? Uh, no, this is like the third or fourth time I've streamed Atlas, uh, and this is the third video I've made. Oh, no, I mean the first treasure, though? Oh, no, this is like, I, I don't know, I, I lost track of how many we've done. I think we've done like seven or eight now. Do they all spawn a million skeletons? Yes, and that's where all the delicious experience comes from. Oh, that's where you level up. Okay. Yeah, that's the reason why uh, I'm about to hit level 42 and everything. I'm trying to get up on that lip. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, because the, the, the beam of light for the treasure is literally right up there. And I have no idea how to get to that, and I didn't bring a climbing pick. I did. I can make you one if you can give me some of the loot. Yeah, we don't mind don't sharing the loot, it. though. I'll, I'll, I'll get up there and I'll drop you the pick. I guess that can work. I mean, unfortunately, uh, because these are in our area, they don't really give the best loot. Um, it's more so just the amazing experience that we're doing these for. Oh. Will we be able to uh, fight them from right here? Um, we might be able to. Hold on, let me get back around. Yeah, it might be close enough for me to get them to spawn, but I'm not sure. Alright, well, let's find out. Good catch. I tried my best. There it is. All right. Oh, I got the air support. <laughs> hey, any help? Because, uh, oof, this might be a little rough. Oh, I see where it is. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're actually on a lip. We're fine. I think. Oh, come... All that delicious experience. Wait for them to pop back up. Yeah, enjoy the experience, because this shit gives tons. Ah, damn, they went down. We have to go hunt them down.
Wait for it to pop back up. Oh, and of course. Eh, whatever, that works. Alright, time for lootations. Let's see if this one gives anything better. Let's see if the rest of these, whatever. Waiting for it to equip. Two hundred ninety gold coins and a whole bunch of blueprints for fine fur equipment. Hey, that's that's good. Let's see. That would be fine hide shirt, a blueprint for a common club with a little bit of additional weapon damage, blueprint for a fine fur cap with additional fortitude, health, weight, and oxygen, um, a fortified repair hammer. A blueprint for a fine plate helmet with additional health, melee damage multiplier. It has two of those and additional oxygen. And fine plate boots with a melee damage multiplier, a speed multiplier, and an additional melee damage multiplier. Heck yeah. It's a little jackpot right there. Indeed. I mean, I'll take every little, every little bonus that we can get because this game is brutal. At least in the beginning stages. Yeah, I'm sure at one point or another we'll end up kicking ass and taking names, but not right now. Right now it's the other way around. See, now the trick is, is we're going to have to get back to base with all this stuff. Like, after we're done hunting all the stuff on this island, we're going to go back to base, drop everything off, and then head out to the other set of islands to try and complete them out there. Um, unless we just want to, you know, not push our luck. Damn it, I am missing every single one. What are your thoughts? Uh, I mean, I would really like to continue to try to push our luck, but in the same token, I really don't. Do we have any more that are on this island? Oh yeah, we still have like three more, I think. And the other one is literally right over there. Let's do it. Yeah. Also, after this next one, I'm going to have to give you some of the gold coins that I looted because they're kind of heavy. Like, 375 oh, gold really? coins. Like, the 375 that we've gotten so far weigh 150. Nice. Bummer. Alright, so you see this little rock out here? Um, it's on top of that. Really good thing you brought that climbing pick. Though, wait, let me check. It might be around here on the other side. Let me see. Okay, no, it's like on the edge of this rock. Wait, no. Nope, never mind. It isn't. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, shit. They spawned. Oh, come! This is the reason why I don't play FPS, kids. Dude, seriously! Good, give me a chance to reload, my god. <laughs> Wait.
wait for him to fully pop up. Oh my god! Can't hit shit, man. Reload and let's go take out the last couple. So much experience, right? Oh yeah, this is great. Seriously? God, that fucker's hard to hit. Oh wait, apparently there's one guardian remaining. Where is he? I'll check over here. Yeah, I don't see anything. Um... Maybe he's up on the top of this rock or at the bottom of the ocean. Holy shit, this water's deep. Yeah, I saw that. He has to be around here somewhere. I actually wouldn't be surprised if he ran off in a, a weird direction. They do that sometimes. Their pathing is really bad. Raining again already? Hmm. 
unequip the map and re-equip it. Plug it in, plug it in. <laughs> no, it's still saying the same thing. There's one guardian left somewhere. Maybe he's over here. to be around here somewhere. I mean, they don't wander like a ridiculous distance, and they always end up coming back. It's just sometimes you have to kind of walk on top of them in order to get them to spawn back in. I would definitely prefer to not have to leave this treasure behind just because one of the guardians decided to wander off to God only knows where. I'm also surprised I haven't seen any bottles. Any luck? No. May have to Looks 86 like this time. in the hill. Maybe. Oh, 
Oh, wait, there. Oh, okay, the event restarted, I think. Hey, cool. Bad time to not have my bow equipped. It seems like they can't attack you in the water. Bucket, reloading my guns in the water. I guess that's one way that you can farm experience. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Seriously? Same happened? Yeah, same thing. It says that there's one guardian left. Alright, so I'm just gonna 86 this map. Yeah.
That's okay, though. We still have four more that we can do here. Let's get her done. Because Did I don't have... Did you put blueprints on my body? Uh, oh, yeah, no. You, you didn't put gold coins on, on me? No. Well, I have 85 gold coins, a blueprint for a fine fur cap, and a blueprint for a fine plate shirt. Interesting. Well, I know the loot is technically supposed to be split. That's how it's supposed to work. Okay. And I got a uh, blueprint for the club. Okay. All right, I think I see where the next spot is. All right, where'd you go? Oh, I saw you. Yeah. I also jacked your climbing pick for a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. Also, interestingly, my bow still has not lost any durability. Mine has it now. Ah, okay. I mean, one time it did. Uh, did you, do you or did you unlock the power shot or whatever it's called? No, not anymore. Hmm. There it is. Really hope this one's on the ground. Let me get some meat. That should be good enough. Stupid lock is messing me up so bad. All right.
right, I have to reload. To deal with Big Beefy over there. Oop, shit. There you go, melee the bastard. <laughs> yeah, boy. I'm about to die anyway again. Ah, okay. Well, let's go ahead and take this this up and see what happens. Blueprint for common grappling hook. Blueprint for plate pants. Throwing knives. Uh, hide shirt. And more money. Alright. Um, let's see. This is garbage, so I'm just going to drop it. Got a blueprint for a tier 2 carriage saddle. And now I'm thinking maybe a trip oh. back to the ship right quick so I can drop some of this gold off. Yeah, I need a diet anyway. There it is. Say, can I just jump on it? Uh oh. Um. I can try and pick you actually to death. The hole. Yeah. Though that's not actually doing any damage. Shit. Can you, like, maybe can we go at war? Is that, can we do that now? Yeah, I can try. I just can't interact with you, right? Yeah, give me a sec. I'm setting up the war thing. <laughs> Who put a hole here? <laughs> Huh, nothing I do is doing any damage. Yeah, I think I'm too low. Um, well I'm still actually hitting you. Well let me let me go kill something. I'll get you some raw meat. Give me a second. Sure. Also, did you want to join our alliance? Like the whole island alliance or no? Uh sure, what what island is it? Uh the big center one. It's um let me see what its name is right quick. Uh Stock Fate Key. Oh, is it in A4, though? Yeah, it's here. A4. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. That's the thing. Uh, I, I, I don't know if I'll be able to accept it, though. Interact with you. So you actually can't even, uh, like, there's no options on me? Yeah, yeah you're, just, like, you're just too far away. Or it's just, I don't want you to fall down here, too. 
Well, I was able to get out of there once. Um, by jumping here in the corner. interact with you now. I am starving and cold, so. Yeah, your health is actually starting to go down. I don't have the option to accept your invite, though. It just says accept war declaration. Hmm. Maybe I'll accept your war declaration and cancel it some. Oh, you're inviting me to a company, not to a, not to an alliance, I think. Okay, there. I invited you to the alliance of Stock Fate Key. There we go. I think I'm in. Yeah, you are. All right, let me go get you some raw meat or something. The server just died. Can you still hear me? Yep. Okay, so maybe the server didn't die. Alright, here, I'm gonna drop some meat down there for you. Alright, <laughs> throw it in the galley. <laughs> Please, sir, just one <laughs> Well, thanks for the suicide. Later. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to end hero right quick and die. <laughs> Yeah, the ladder is really finicky. There we go. Best way to restore your stats. It's glitched. I can't climb up. I just jumped off the rock. Well, I guess that works.
Alright, well now that my stow oh, shit, did you just get stuck down there? That's alright, there's ways to get out, especially once we're moving. Ah, okay. Though we still have a couple maps to do here. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Jump! You can do it! Um, give me my climbing pick. Maybe that'll work. So, fingers crossed. No surface to climb. Oh. What about a little rope ladder or something? Unfortunately, that's not something that I can make, and a regular ladder is way too big. It gets uh, obstructed. If I kill myself, do you think I'll be able to reach my inventory from up there? Um, maybe? Honestly, it might be better for you just to kind of throw everything at me. I'll pick it up and then I'll just, I don't know, shoot you in the head with an arrow. Okay, sure. And you already took off your armor, right? It's still showing you with armor on. Oh no! Oh no! All right, is that everything? Yeah. All right, stop moving so I can shoot you. <laughs> I actually want to see if I'm light enough to jump out first. Oh, ah, okay. I'm going to go ahead and put the gold coins in the chest and your uh, stuff. Okay, kill me at your leisure. We really need to get a rope ladder installed on this thing. <laughs> Ow, stop it, that hurt. next one anyway. Okay.
All right, I also uh, stocked you up with a couple extra arrows. Thank you, sir. And uh, once you get geared back up, we'll go ahead and uh, head out and do the next one. I think there's two more that we can do here. Okay, so it's like right there. Okay. <clears throat> oh yeah, side note, we know where uh, Syrup on the island is now, so pretty much everything is here. Might have to take a little trip for it and whatnot, but I mean, everything is here on this island. Well, not this island specifically, but the big one, the main one. Sorry about that. No worries. I'm ready whenever you are. All right. Aren't these kind of fun though? Yeah, yeah. It's um definitely better than Seven Days to Die, where you just go dig a chest and you're done. Yeah, and also trying to find that chest can be a massive pain in the ass. Oh my gosh, I've dug up mountains. <laughs> I believe it. Ah, bear. Oh, great. A wolf. Um, and, yeah, our spot is just past the wolf. Alright, let's take a bow. Maybe the birds will kill it. Maybe. That works. Can't see shit past these trees. Oh wait, there it is. Oh no, the bees! Frickin' bees. I don't even see it. Oh, is it dead already? Yeah, the bee's dead. Alright, it's right up here on top of this rock. Alright, regaining stamina. Alright, I'll wait a second then. Alright, go for it. Assuming I can get up here. Here you go. Oh, I still have your climbing pick, apparently. Oops. Okay, yeah. I couldn't find it. Here, don't want to drop it down for you as well. Hey, you, watch out. Hey, you up in the hill, watch out. Oh, shit. You're welcome to come help. Get screwed. Oh, <laughs> shit. 
Oh, shit! Oh no, the last swing got him. No, actually, I accidentally shot him. No, actually, I accidentally shot him with an arrow. <laughs> <laughs> and because we can damage people who are uh, in our same clan, yeah. Wait, you can damage people in your clan? Yes. We can shoot them, we can hit them with pickaxes, swords, we can damage them like it's full PvP. What? Yep. Yeah, this is a PvE server. I'm not sure why it's like that, but basically friendly fire is a thing. Wow, that's crazy. Right? I see you. Yay! Like I said, I picked up uh, your stuff. At least I'm pretty sure I picked it all up. Let me go ahead and uh, dig this up, and uh, then I'll give you your, your stuff back. Alright. You didn't realize you killed me, right? Yeah, yeah. The 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 the, the thing died, and then my arrow just went boop, right through your head. Yeah. Huh. Okay. We just got a blueprint for a shield. Yeah. Blueprint for a common heavy shield. Got an, uh, a blueprint for I a grappling that. hook, and then some common plate gloves that have uh, additional fortitude, intelligence, and melee damage multiplier on it. I got um, more 41 more coins, a common sickle with more weapon damage, so that's cool. Um, awesome. And pants. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... Yes, feed me boxes.
and let me go ahead and uh, split up these bullets and whatnot. Okay, cool. And then the uh, update will happen in 10 more minutes. Uh, let's not do anything else because it'll roll back. Yeah, I think we should just go back to the ship. And then we can uh, do them. We we're going to go back to the ship twice. <laughs> maybe. Uh, but I mean, it's still another 10 minutes away before they actually launch it. So maybe we won't roll back that far. Maybe. Do you guys got another treasure here or are you done now? Uh, we still have two more treasure maps we have to do on this island specifically. How did you get so many? Just walking around, you just found that many? Uh, basically, the the way that the treasures work is you'll find bottles really close to shorelines, more specifically uh, against bigger tidbits of land. Um, I didn't really see any bottles out here, but if you travel over to the mainland, um, you'll see bottles everywhere. They glow. <laughs> They're really hard to miss. And it's not the boxes yeah, I, that I float up in the water. But they're just they're for everywhere. Points. I'm surprised you guys have seven for one island. Yeah, I mean, we've been looting the ever-living hell out of them. I think we looted, like, 40 different maps yesterday alone in, like, 40 minutes. And, uh, well, that's where all the A4 maps came from. Oh, okay. I mean, we have some, uh, like, I think we have a 10-quality one, but it's all the way over in, like, G3 or something like that. Yeah, I have a 26 one that says it's going to give 2,000 gold, but it's like... Jesus! Hey, we'll you guys it. want it, actually? We'll never sail that far in five days if you want to. Oh, I, I don't think that we'll even be able to sail that far in five days. Yeah, we've got a galleon to finish. Exactly. Started. But priorities. Indeed. Okay, carry on, folks. All right, dude. Thanks for your help. Yes, much appreciated. Yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, I guess, let's head back to the ship and then wait for the server to die, and then I guess I'll see you in about uh, 15 minutes after that. Whenever everything comes back online, anyway. Then we can uh, do these last two maps. It might be a little bit difficult because I know one of your pistols is broken. But I think we'll manage. Don't go through the water. Uh. Found, found that there was a rollback. I logged in, in the water and died. Oh, fun. Well, hopefully that's uh, not the case for this, because that would be very unfortunate. Uh, did I drop two bows? Yes. Whoops. Thank you. Oof. I don't know what's with the framiness all of a sudden. Oh, come. Thank you, good sirs. You're welcome. Yeah, I definitely feel like the server is about to shut off because of, uh, like, this insane framiness that I just got out of the blue. Yeah. 600 coins, 240 pounds worth. Jesus. Well, assuming we can get back to home nice and safe, you know, that'll come in handy for after the update launches. We can maybe venture out and go find a free port and, uh, I don't know, find a way to spend it. I'm not going to be able to be off for much, too much longer. Yeah. You think you have another two maps in you? Sure. Okay. 
I mean, we don't have to do them if you don't want to. We can just hold off on it. No, I, we're already here. Let's try to get that done for sure. Okay. Um, well, I guess we'll have to wait for uh, everything to come back up. And like I said, I'll see you uh, after the server resets. Trying to store stuff that stacks. Or, I'm sorry, our gear, whereas, like, the stackables, like, stone and wood and thatch and stuff, I'll go ahead and take that out. There we go. All right, um, can you still hear me? Yeah. Okay, uh, we'll go ahead and say bye to the stream. <laughs> Absolutely, guys. Goodbye, stream. Yay. See y'all after the reset. All right, well, there it is. Uh, we did some maps that took a little bit longer than I was hoping to, uh, but I mean, it happens, I guess, you know, the deaths, we didn't come fully prepared or everything, we just kind of geared up and went. Um, but, I'm really looking forward to this patch, I'm hoping that it's going to fix a whole bunch of stuff. Um, if you're curious as to the patch notes, and you're too lazy to go check the forum, check out my previous video that's uploaded on the channel. Um, it talks briefly about the updates that are about to launch in this coming patch. Um, and if you like the video, go ahead and leave a thumbs up, maybe consider subscribing. I do plan on posting a lot more Atlas videos. I mean, I love this game. Uh, fucking mosquito, seriously. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'll see y'all around.